I'm back, better, bigger, and brighter. So happy to be back on this channel with such a powerful message to all the women who are in abusive relationships. I am so happy that I want to share this specific point with you and I hope you're going to get it in the right way and that you're going to liberate yourself from any toxic relationship that you've been. I want to talk about women in relationships and when things go bad. Now, there is a very fine line that we need to understand for you to be able to be yourself and be happy in a relationship. Women who are in toxic relationships in most, most of the times is because you have gone ahead and given power to the man to dictate what is right and what is wrong. Now, my specific Point that I would like you to take home today and please tell me that you're gonna understand my point please please I beg you it's a point of liberation it is a point that needs to sink well inside your mind and it is a point that if you grasp it properly you are going to have healthy relationship or you will not and uh, let yourself be in a relationship you are not happy with now, the point is, men most of the times tend to go around and twist a story and bring the story back and makes it look like you are the problem. A man will go and cheat and when you find out, he will make it a way that you are the problem. A man will start flirting with other women. A man will start making you feel jealous. A man will start um, um, avoiding you in different ways. And then when you try to confront that issue, they make it seem as if you are the problem, as if you are the one who is nagging, as if you are the one who is, uh, who is, who is the problem? Now, my point that I want you to take home is that you are never the problem. When a man decides to cheat, when a man decides to go out and not text you or go missing or anything, just remember, and please, my dear sister, put this in your mind and let it sink at the back of your head. Le remember that when a man does this, he is the problem. He is the one who is trying to satisfy his ego. As people say, men think when they sleep with many women, it makes them feel manly. It satisfies their ego. Do not fall prey of thinking that you are the problem when a man goes out and does something that you don't like. When a man makes you feel inferior, when a man makes you feel you are not enough, you are not the problem. He is the problem. He is trying to deal with, he, uh, with his insecurities. He is trying to deal with his own issues inside him and he's trying to prove it to you. And instead of you understanding and reading the man and knowing that this man has got issues, you tend to take those problems and put them into yourself, internalize them and start overburdening yourself thinking that you are the problem in the relationship. You start looking for ways on how to fix yourself in this situation. Now, you cannot fix yourself in this situation. The minute you understand that the man is the one who has issues, the man is the one who needs to fix himself and not you, then you are liberating yourself you are detaching yourself from toxic relationship from abusive relationship from unhealthy relationship you are now getting to know yourself and you will appreciate yourself you will never allow anybody to bring any negativity into you when you are in a relationship you will work towards something healthy you will work towards something you like but you will not allow yourself to be um, crowned or to be to be inside a place where you feel you are in an, a healthy relationship. Always remember, 
if something goes wrong look at it in a logical manner do not try and put the problem in you and start uh, start eating yourself from inside and being so hard on yourself that there's something wrong with you there's nothing wrong with you look at the other person and realize the issues they are facing and the issues that they are trying to impose on you differentiate that and be happy I have been in bad relationships before where I felt that I was the issue I felt that I am the one who didn't know how to care for a man I am the one who was too clingy I am the one who did not know how to to behave like I kept on putting all this I kept on asking myself what is the issue with me what is the problem with me and in the long run things just tend to be more tensed more sour and it just doesn't add up you ask yourself i'm trying to do everything but the one thing that i never got or i never understood was that i used to take the problem of the men and make them be my problems so i used to overburden myself in these relationships feeling so heavy that i take it as if it is me who has the problem when i when the the truth is the man had the problem the man is the one who was not maybe ready to settle down the man is the one who wanted to to go around he had the issues he was the issue from the word go but i never saw that all i thought was oh let me try make this thing work let me try this let me try that but in the long run it was a headache it was something so tiresome and it was something that was not really making me feel myself and it was making me lose myself in the relationship it was making me lose myself but the minute i came to understand that men do have issues in relationship and majority of the men who have issues in relationship they try to make the woman think they are the issue it is a very big game going on out there majority of men whose women are not happy in relationship in most cases they try to play with the woman's psychology and make them feel as if they are the problem in the relationship and they need to fix that problem and they know when the woman uh, succumbs to that and when she is vulnerable and doesn't know what to do they enjoy that game don't fall for that game when you know that the man has issues and he got to fix it you will walk away confidently telling my telling yourself this is not where I want to be this is not the relationship that I want to be you will walk away gracefully confidently without a shadow of doubt on yourself that this is not whatever because now you know the problem is not you and you have no powers to fix the problem he got to pick it yeah, he got to pick up his pieces and fix the problem himself are we together girls gentlemen they do not move or they do not skip from what they show their women out there they are proud of who they are they are confident of themselves you come in you go in with someone who has all the insecurities they are insecure of themselves they are not even able to 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 to, to show you to the world they are hiding you on social medias they are doing all these things behind you they are flirting with like 20 women on their social media to boost their ego and then you are here poor you beautiful intelligent confident woman you are here beating yourself that you are the one who has the problem he got the problem let him fix his problem and be a man enough do not fall for that shit do not fall for that thing I claim your crown back and walk head held high thanks for watching till next time goodbye